The Steel Timber Sports Australian Trophy is in St Kilda, Victoria. And Braden Meyer has beaten Chris Owen in the first quarter final to lock in a semi-final spot. And in the second quarter final, Argent or Gillum will be looking to join him. But it's no secret Argent is the one to beat, and Gillum knows it. Mitch Argent rolled out of Queensland. He's proved his form here once before. He's been over and uh, competed representing Australia. But knowing Mitch, he'll be backing it up here yet again this year, giving it his all. So, which heavy hitter will make it to the semi finals? Three, two, one, go! after earning a top four spot in the time trial round and having an all-important rest with his bye straight into the quarters. But Argent, he's coming in hard and takes a slight lead in the early stages. Gillum looks to be primed and ready. Just look at the axe speed of the big man. It's incredible. Argent stays ahead. Hot on his heels is Gillum. He won't want to let the Queenslander get away from him. They're neck and neck. On to the single buck, and this is where Gillum will want to pull away from Argent. He's been one of the top single buckers in the competition over the past few years. Whereas Argent has struggled to find a style that suits him. It's looking good for both the guys, but as they near the bottom of the log, they hook up simultaneously. Argent recovers quickly, however, Gillum struggles to find his rhythm again. Argent a four-hit lead and being arguably the best standing block cutter in the world. It's going to be a hard task for Gillum to take it back. Argent puts in the drivers. And he's through to the semi-finals. A bit of rivalry between the two. He's happy with his effort here in St Kilda. What an incredible heat. Oh, I don't know how it looked, but um, no, it felt pretty good. Me and Glenn got a little rivalry, you know. And the Australian team was either me or him cutting the standard block, so well, it's good to get a win over Glenn. So with Argent edging out Gillum in the second quarter final, he will secure his spot in the semis and will line up to take on the man to beat so far, Braden Meyer.